In Paramill, collision checking has been improved. If I right click on my machine tool and then open up the collisions form, you can now see that there is a simple on off checkbox to turn collision checking on and there is also a new field called, cl called clearance value. By entering a value here, you are telling Paramill to check for near miss collisions. Those where there is not a collision, but where the machine tool falls within a certain clearance. So by putting in a clearance value of 10, I'm telling Paramill to check for any near misses between a full collision and where the machine tool passes within 10 millimeters of a collision. With that value entered, I can now simulate a toolpath and immediately I get a collision. However, as you can see, our machine tool is colored yellow. This represents a near miss. If I keep playing through the simulation, our collision table will start to fill out. If we have a distance, that means that it is a near miss, and if it is a zero, that is a full-on collision. If I just pause the simulation where it is, you can see the machine tool is now red. That means that a full collision is taking place. If I wanted to input a different clearance value, say 20, I would then have to rerun my simulation in order to update this table. This update is perfect for any person who requires a machine tool to clear collisions by a certain amount. Also, the new user interface simply makes it easier to read where on the part the collision is occurring.